Okay everybody, this is a tutorial on how to download Hypercam and use Windows Movie Maker. First you go to Google and type in Hypercam free download. And then you go to the hyperonics.com download. Uh, you scroll down to Hypercam. Um, you click the button and then you go to um, uh, another button, download Hypercam. And there's also another button, uh, just get our latest version, that's right on the front page. Uh, so right here I'm going to click US Server 1. And then you're going to want to save the file into whatever file path you want. Now you will be going to open up the Hypercam. And, uh, you know, start, record, uh, things like that. Hotkeys, you can just push a button to start recording and everything. Um, AVI file, click browse and choose the file path. If you're making RuneScape videos, just, I mean whatever videos, just unclick record sound. Um, here's where you can record your mouse and stuff. Again, RuneScape videos don't record the mouse. Uh, let's see, here's where you can get a license that's unregistered. And thanks to uh, Assassinator, he hooked me up with a registration code, so thank you. Okay, right here you are going to want to open Windows Movie Maker. Okay, so as you can see here, I'm just adding an effect by clicking on Add Effects. And here's what it looks like on the big view and everything. Um, let's see. Right here is like total lagging. <laughs> okay, now inserting transition. You just add it to the line and it comes up like that. Um, right now I am actually in timeline. There's a button that just so show storyboard, show timeline, and it's a lot more normal if you do show timeline. That's the only really good way to edit. Um, here's how to add a title or a credit or whatever you want to add. You click like, on select a clip after you select a clip. That's something you kind of got to figure it out. Figure it out. Um, right here is where it gets totally hard and crappy because. Uh, I started lagging when I put this in, and then I tried to put on my, um, I tried to change where the, like, it totally made the voice off, so, I'll just edit this part off, but that's how you change color and change text and everything. Okay, so that pretty much concludes the video, but right here is just, uh, control L, split clip, or the button that has, like, two little cinema clip roll things by the movie preview and to save it properly to upload to YouTube, um, you do save movie file, name it, and then let it render. Alright, thanks for watching this.